It's designed to be provocative, to get people to open their eyes. Whether you're driving or walking downtown these days, you may do a double take. Mysterious billboards springing up all over town. A cell phone wrapped in a condom. And if you find it disturbing, it's supposed to be. Why there are beds on Bradford Beach right now. The eye-opening reminder that may be on the way to your mailbox. Raising a stink at Milwaukee bus stops. That is a real person up there tonight, actually underneath those blankets. Shaking things up at the hardware store. They call their tactic guerrilla marketing. The idea is that it sneaks up on you. Our goal is to get people's attention. Well, that ought to do it. The billboards show polar opposites are rivals coming together for charity. The sound will be heard on every radio station in Milwaukee at the same time. The ads remind women that those close to them need them to be healthy. A child sleeping in a window well. Teens texting naked pictures. The OneMilwaukee.org anti-violence campaign. The United Way's Unity campaign. The unique new campaign to help increase breast cancer awareness. A bold new effort to combat teen pregnancy in Milwaukee. The life-saving messages that are actually working in Milwaukee. The rise in homeless teens in Milwaukee sparking a new ad campaign to raise awareness. They tackle the issue of statutory rape. The powerful ad is from the same Milwaukee marketing group responsible for the controversial pregnant boy ad. The nonprofit marketing agency Serve, Serve, a Milwaukee ad agency, Serve has set up this fake payday loan store. The ad agency Serve is taking the issue head on. It's trying to make sure that teens think twice before getting pregnant. Getting guns off Milwaukee's streets. Get women thinking about how the disease impacts the men in their lives. Organizers hope men read these stickers and do as it says. So far more than 7,000 people have visited babycanwait.com. And the phone lines have been busy. 11,000 calls in a month and a half. And within a week of these going up, 500 people gave a call. In mid-May, the shaken baby cases stopped. Raised a record $44 million. Milwaukee's teen pregnancy rate is at its lowest level in nearly 30 years. The uh, Shaken Baby Association, their hotline there, they saw their call volume actually double. May be a little controversial, but if it's getting 1,100 calls a week, it's, it's working. working. He really thinks that this particular ad is going to have the impact. And I can tell you, when I watched it, it yeah. gave me goosebumps. Yeah, me to too. See it.